Okay guys, today we're talking about one thing of two I really hate in Florida. The other thing is love bugs, which are extremely bad right now. Well, I, well no, don't jinx it. Don't jinx it. Don't do it. But this is the bouquet of uh, dollar weeds I just picked. Here, honey. I know, aren't they? Yeah, everywhere. 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 So, and they're a real problem in the front yard, too. Two and a half years we've been trying to get rid of these, so we're going to try something new. Yes, because we thought we could choke them out with this uh, Scott's grass seed. Not so much. It did grow. It is growing. But. But it's getting to the point where we need to do something else because these are still trying to take over. They are taking over, and I'm bagging with the lawnmower and things like that. So. We're going to try this. Now with this stuff, can't let your, your your dog out, small children out. Uh, you can't really let anything until out. Until it's dry, because you have to put it down and then water it, and then until it's dry, you can't let anybody on it. Yes, you have to have a dry yard when you put it down. Then you have to wet the yard, and then you have to keep everything off the yard, because I guess it will kill it, because it's a three-in-one. It yeah. kills dollar weeds and clovers, fertilizer, and uh, insects. Yeah, which is huge. Yes, because uh, hopefully it will kill some of these love bug larvae. Well, all our neighbors have um, lawn that is pretty nice, and they use a, a certain company out there that I'm not going to name, but they're popular around here. And they all use it, and they all have great lawns. So they say that this is kind of comparable to what they use, and our soil is is really kind of unhealthy and so this is why we're doing this because of the fertilizer as well well we'll see and we'll stick it down and we'll look for results you can only put this down up to two two times a year and you have to wait eight weeks after the first application before you put down the second application mm -hmm. so this stuff sounds really potent and it was only twenty dollars off Amazon so I've left the link down below if it works, stay tuned for that video. Get you some. You touched it. You touched it where it had the dookie on it. Oh, I'm sorry. Ew. Oh, I touched the dookie speaker scissors in the wrong spot. These Ew. are for our dog. But we'll open this up. There. I'm going to fill up the hopper. Now, it doesn't show this hopper anywhere on uh, the bag. So it says right here for the wheel hoppers, you use four and a half to eight and a half. Four and a quarter to eight and a half. But let's see if I can do it with this one. Okay. All filled up. And let's we'll spray it out. Okay, so I'm going to show you what it looks like spraying out. Be sure not to get this on any of your plants because it will kill them. And don't get it on your dog either. It may kill that too. So I get this spread out and then we'll uh, come back with a new video. So y'all stay tuned for this outro. Okay. We put the uh, whole bag down. Hopefully that rectifies the issue of dollar weeds. Don't want to give Danielle any more dollar weed bouquets. <laughs> I don't even get regular ones. She doesn't like flowers. Oh, she does. I'm sorry. I saw her <laughs> lip that. But uh, we also leave a link down below for the uh, blue, uh, was it uh, bluegrass? Yeah, whatever. The Scots bluegrass that yeah. we put down. And uh, 
you know, it did do as well as we'd liked it to. Uh, maybe the dollar weeds are choking out no, or our yard I, sucks. I'm pretty sure we have really um, unhealthy soil. It's been a problem since we've moved here, so we're about to rectify it with this. Hopefully. Hopefully. And get rid of them dollar weed bouquets. Mm -hmm. Danielle doesn't like them. Well, they just take over everything, and it looks, it looks ugly. <laughs> if y'all are looking for great eats, good recipes, check out dininginwithdanielle.com. Wonderful meals released every Wednesday. Yummy. And uh, they, are. they are. They are really good. Dining in with Danielle. Not to be like, you know, a brat about my own recipes, but I've been eating them very for very picky. I'm very picky, so. I've been eating them for 20 years. I love them. Love them a lot. And if you uh, like this channel, subscribe. Hit that little bell. Little bell goes ding. Well, really, it doesn't. Just remind you. If you like this video, hit that like button. It's down there also. Looks like this. Oh yeah, I already did that. It does look like that. <laughs> and y'all please take care.